Oh, wow. So this um, Doghouse Cafe, um, what inspired you behind it? Um, what is it? Interesting question. So um, I've always loved dogs and um, my business partners have always loved dogs as well when, when we started that. And I used to feed my dog a lot of raw meat. Um, and I was buying – I always just assumed it was – normal meat that I was buying beef and just giving her raw meat. And I realized um, after a little bit of time that she'd be vomiting this meat that I would give her. And I couldn't work out why. So then I started talking to some butchers and people in the meat industry and they're telling me that the meat that I'm buying is definitely coming from a knackery. Yeah. So for those that don't know what that is, that's where um, – disease stock or dead stock or whatever go and it gets minced and they make all sorts of things out of it but it's not definitely not for human consumption um it could be disease it might not be disease but it's 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 not what i would put in my body and yeah if i wouldn't do it i wouldn't feed my dog that um so when i realized that and uh when i realized that i, I made i was shocked about what I was feeding my dog, because I thought I was giving her good food. I thought I was giving her meat and, you know, as a treat, I thought I was, I was doing the right thing. So when I realized that um, this stuff was like, I felt cheated. So what I, I literally did a post on Facebook that went absolutely viral. I said, if there was a restaurant for dogs, who would go? And my idea wasn't to start a restaurant or a cafe. At the time it was to start a food delivery business for dogs, delivering fresh food, but quality product that has some kind of standing, that it's not just some fallen stock or disease stock or whatever it is. Some delivering a consistent product and, and doing it on almost like a like a light and easy sort of model, yeah. but for pets. Um, wow. But then when I put up that post and I said, who would, who would go, um, who would take their dog to a dog restaurant? We literally got absolutely smashed by every, every news outlet, like if you look at it today, it still um, it still pops up on my on my Facebook memories and things. But every major news like channel seven, nine, ten, Nova, MTV, you you name it, they jumped on it and they were it, was, it went absolutely mental the um, the exposure we got from it because it was just it was such a new concept that that no one had done and there were a lot of dog lovers in Melbourne or Australia in general that. Um, that spoil their dogs and treat their dogs really well, and it was a it was a unique place to take their dogs to to give them a treat. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand.